time we're springing forward it's now an hour earlier than usual driving to school an hour earlier than usual you know uh, usually on daylight savings time day I'm like screw you you stupid clock changing government power to the people you know mm -hmm. I woke up this morning at 4:20. And not because I wanted to smoke some weed <laughs> at 420, but I had this horrible dream about you. Because, like, I don't know what the hell we were doing. We were, like, in L.A., in, like, a bad part of L.A., but there was no one around. We were, like, uh, downtown in, like, the ghetto area where all the bums are. I get it. Uh, Skid Row, that's it. So we were at Skid Row. Maybe I'm thinking about Skid Row because I was singing Skid Row this weekend, the band Skid Row. Anyways, me and you were there, and we were trying to, like, get on this wall, like, climb a wall or something, or we were trying to post something to the wall, like, a paper or something, I forget. But you were reading something, and in, I turned around, and you were reading something to me, like, uh, an assignment for high school, or for school, not high school, but just, like, a school assignment. And you're like, oh, I didn't do this. I Here's this paper I was supposed to write, and I didn't do it, and it was due yesterday. And I looked at you, and I was all super pissed, right? <laughs> I was just like, gah. And so, for some reason, I threw you down on the ground, but you didn't like, it wasn't like I threw you down, and your face was like, splat! That kind of throwing down on the ground. I threw you down into a perfect... Uh, Indian position. So all of a sudden your legs went whoop, into an Indian position. And uh, and I kicked you. <laughs> and so like I, threw, I was some kind of like... Like a pinball almost because you flew across the street. Like it was a four lane, like a big street. And all of a sudden you went <laughs> like in your little like, like that floating across the street. And I was like, oh my god, because I didn't, I didn't, I only meant to kick you a little bit. I didn't mean to <laughs> kick you all the way across the street. And you go flying across the street, and then you hit the curb. And when you hit the curb, I could tell that I totally broke your hip. And I was like, I was so mortified by how horrible of a person I would be to throw you into Indian position and then kick you across the street like a pinball until you broke your hip, right? Well, that, that wasn't it. As soon as you hit the curb, broke your hip, you flew up in the air, like all floppy style, you know, like people are like, bleh, bleh, bleh. and then you oh, hit okay. the wall, like way up high too, like you hit that curb and then you bounced up in like 20 feet in the air, <laughs> hit this wall and was like, blah, and then you flopped down like a dead, just <laughs> floppy dead person. This seems like a dream version of Happy Wheels. And I was like, oh my God. And then I woke up and I was like, <gasps> Oh. I think I would be laughing because all of that ear, ear unrealisticness. Yeah. No way, man. It freaked me out. I thought for sure I broke your hip and smashed you into a 20 foot wall. But that was all so ridiculous. Well, I couldn't go back to sleep because all I was thinking about was I wonder if Zoe has an assignment that's missing that I need to go check Zangle. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I need to check your school grades and make sure because I haven't checked them in a while. I'm like, hmm, why would I have a dream about kicking Zoe Indian style? Like if she was sitting all Indian position or whatever. I don't know why I wanted to kick you so bad. Like I was mad and I just wanted to kick you. 
It's weird. Did you have any dreams last night? Um, I think I had some dream about bowling with a friend. You were a bowling ball in my dream. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird, man. It's not that weird. Someone asked if I wanted to go bowling this Saturday. Oh. This past Saturday? No, th this Saturday. Oh, this coming up Saturday? Yeah. Are you going to go bowling? If you drive me there, and you let me go, I mean... Who asked you? friend you don't know, but she wants to go and hang out mm. with me. I don't know. It's a friend I don't know. Don't be one of those parents like, I must know all your friends or you can't have them as a friend. Well, you know, you're only 17. Uh, and your judgment has already been proven faulty because you... you I'm won't... such a bad kid. I do all these exactly, bad things. Exactly. All these drugs and alcohol. Like, every time Man. we're down in Skid Row and we're trying to put <laughs> stuff on the wall, you're always like, oh, I forgot to do that assignment. And then I have to kick you across the street. I mean, I might be doing something bad because I'm almost an adult. Well, that's not the reason you wouldn't be doing something bad. It would be because you're doing something bad. Not because you're an adult. I did a ton of stuff bad when I was a kid. I'm 17 I an and adult. I still haven't done anything that you've done. So. Yes, you have. What? You freaking didn't do assignments in school. Oh my god, that doesn't count. I mean, actual bad things that count. Those count. Those are nerdy things. Getting I an mean, F counts, okay? That's, that's not a good thing. Okay. That counts. Be glad I get bad grades in school instead of like wasting my life away with drugs and alcohol at least i have a social life unlike, unlike you did hey why you gotta bring me into this you wouldn't have why a good got, social why life why, i do why you gotta start talking crap on me and how i was as a kid when we're we're discussing you and how how horrible of a person you are to go bowling with a girl i don't know that's so awful not like i'm going bowling with some guy you don't know not like i would do anything What's this person's name? Diana. Okay, that wouldn't be a boy's name. I was going to say, if it was some kind of androgynous name, I'd be like, like yeah, Alex. right. Sure, it's a girl. Alex or Chris. Is it going to be like a yeah. group of people or just you no, two? No, just me and her. She's just it's like, like a oh. date? No. She just wants to hang out. No. Oh. With you? Yeah. Man, what's wrong with her? Wow. I just hung out with my best friend. <laughs> Well, it's different. Hannah loves you no matter what. You don't know my <laughs> relationships with my friends. You don't know how close I am to them. I don't talk about all my friends. I don't care. You can go bowling. More free time for me. <laughs> me and your mom all do something together. How much does bowling together. even cost? More than it should. It's a stupid ball rolling it down and hitting pins. Come on. How much does bowling cost? It depends on the time of day. I don't know. I need to ask. If your friend's inviting you on the date, she should pay for it. Mm, I don't know. Just don't give her, a, don't give up anything but a kiss. Yeah. Okay. On the first date. Not a date. Which bowling alley? She said Brunswick, I think. On foot They're Hill. all Brunswick. On foothill. And it's not Brunswick. What are we in? Friggin' Germany? I don't know how to pronounce it. Brunswick sein da. It, it just looked like Brunswick to me. It's Brunswick. Same thing. She said Brunswick on Foothill. That's uh, the one in Upland that we just passed. Alright, well, bowling for you. Me and Mom hanging out, doing what we want to do. That's fine. We'll go see a cool movie or something. Know. We'll play, uh, we'll p practice our ukulele skills. Okay. You do that. Do you like the ukulele that Mom and I have been playing? I think it's a cute instrument. Yeah. I have the small one. The orange one? Yeah. That makes sense because my hands are so much smaller oh, yeah. than your mom's. But the brown one looks more like a mini guitar. Yeah. Like, I mean, they all look like mini guitars, but like, that one's bigger. I didn't, I thought they were all just small, same size ukuleles. If I get a tax return this year, I gotta get some tinted windows. This is bullshit. <laughs> well, 
I hope everybody has a good Monday on this uh, daylight savings day. It's going to be light out later, so that means when I get home from work, I can do yard work now. Yay. Yard work. Ooh, sounds fun. Especially how your body is doing now. No, I'm a mess right now. Just All right, take it easy, people. I'm sorry for shining sun right in your face. <laughs> See ya.